How's everybody? Ready to go? The weatherman was wrong, so it's a nice day today. So we better uh, we better get training here. So just some same feel of sets. We'll work our you know we're gonna work on all sides of our body all the time, and we'll do some fancy fast hand stuff. Um, I think again that rolling rolling your wrists over versus being choppy is really important. So just be loose with your wrists. Remember the top hand is doing most of the work. The bottom hand is just a guide. Okay, and uh, and again, remember whatever I'm doing here, you need to do more reps on your own. So, um, you know, this is always good to do these workouts one more time. If they challenge you, it shouldn't be the only workout you do in the week. You should have, you know, maybe add one of these as well. So we're trying to make it fun and interesting. There's nothing too fancy with equipment. It's it's most of the stuff you saw in the video. And, uh, and yeah, we'll have fun with it. Okay, so first one, I'll start off with, with uh, two balls or two pucks, just to keep two balls or two pucks going, okay? I'll put you all on mute there. We can use two, uh, two of the stick handling balls. So let's go uh, righty lefty or lefty righty. So I'll start with this ball on the left, then I'll switch hands and go with this ball on the right. Then ball on the left, then ball on the right. Ball on the left, then ball on the right. Ball. Then I'll come over to ball on the right, but I'm switching hands as I'm doing that. And maybe these balls move a lot, so I can use, I can use two of the, uh, two of the green pucks as well, if I wanted. I like to it gives me fast hands, so I can go lefty, lefty, righty over here. A little slow to righty. Righty. Balls make it more of a challenge for sure. Okay? So lefty ready with the ball. Ready. Switching hands as you go under. You could use a hurdle. You could use anything. You don't even need a hurdle. Let's start with a little bit of running. All 
first cone on my back hand. That'll put me to a forehand in the middle. I might use a puck for this one if this one's too rough. Backhand on the outside, forehand in the middle. Okay, so when I finish that one, that's one set there and back. So now I'll go forehand on the outside, backhand in the middle, forehand on the outside, backhand in the middle. And I'll go backhand, forehand, backhand. Sometimes we cross our hands on turns, and sometimes we leave it beside us. So again, you can kind of practice both of those. So you're just alternating your outside, middle, outside, middle. But I would go there and back. And then I might change my direction. It will be the same way around the middle each time. Try 30 seconds on this one. yourself a little break, catch your breath. Now uh, this time, let's go around each one, around each one, forward to backwards. So I'm going to come around. You can keep your hands going in this one. Let's keep us stick handling and being twitchy. Ready.
Five seconds. Look to make a pass to somebody. Ready? Uh, 
side, my forehand side. You don't want to start on my backhand side. So I'll go three over here. And three on this side. Okay, and we'll just get a feel for, for circular motion and hands away. You could use pucks too. These could be pucks. That's where I probably should have used pucks. So grab, just grab the, the brown pucks. How many? Three, replace the cones. So I just replaced them with the pucks. We'll just go circular now. And they see all the pucks there. Three on this side, three on this side. So I think we did this one before. This is where I start below. So I come around below and then I figure eight. Then I gotta come all the way across below. Here eight. You come back down below, start below. Here eight, always put your knee over. And down. Unfold turn. as I can, okay? Three sets. Three sets of that would be good. Nate, Nate thinks we haven't done that one, so that's good. Maybe it'll be, if it's a new one, then that's good too. Okay. Ready? You're going up and back three times. you work really hard on this backhand side as deep as you can. So that's any of the drills that get us, like I said before, on your backhand side. I'm sure some of you were up here. Some of you were up here just working here. That doesn't get me on my backhand side. So whatever I can do to get as much on my backhand side.
Good, grab yourself a drink if you need one. We'll continue with those six bucks. We'll keep that weave going. Cross 
another challenging one let's make sure i got everybody still good lots of people so that's good so that was toe pull then i can work my way again oh, no, i think that's good on those yeah that's good on those so i'm gonna give you some more Little change it up a little now. We're half, just halfway through. So I don't need these pucks. Oh yeah, I do. I'll use my pucks. This will be a cool one. So I'm gonna have a four puck pattern, five puck pattern. So this will be the pattern. And we could probably practice this pattern a little bit. So let's say I'm gonna go, I'll go ball. And puck so they don't move too much. But let's say I start up at the top. Let's say I come through, I gotta work my way down on these three. And then I gotta hit the outside on these three. Then I gotta work my way up. And then I gotta work my way across and I work my way up and I work my way across. I work my way up. Too many, that's okay though. I go too many. My way up. So I work my way down. Work across. directions going but I always did an up and down and I always did an across Thank <laughs> you. 
then we'll add to it. I'll put one on the outside here and one on the outside on this side as well. Okay. So not too different, except you got two outside things that it's got to go under. Okay. And we'll still hit those figure eights. I got to try and figure eight through each pot as well. Okay. Sometimes I find it easier to go through the middle. Sometimes I'll pop up to the top. So let's say I started here and came through. I'm up to the top. I got to work my way down. I got to work my way out of there. And I went to this side first because I knew I had to get across still. So again, just to give you an idea, out, under, I could, I'm probably going to go up first. I got to hit my weave down, and then the puck I've missed is this guy. So I got to come back through so I can get under here. Now let's say I went straight through the middle, and I did that, then I would come down, and then I would go up to get the ball. We'll try it live and fast for one. Live and fast. I'll put you all on gallery. Ready.
going to hit that one one more time probably. So you see lots of you got your figure eight set up. Tough to be smooth on that and tough to pick your head up once in a while. I know for me, I'm still looking down a little bit. Um, but a lot of hand work, a lot of leg shifts, a lot of just a good workout in that, in that progression, okay? If you didn't have the unders on the outside, you could go around a cone on the outside as well. You could go around a cone also, okay? So uh, that's all good, right? So we'll, do, we'll add this one one more time for speed, but we'll just go 30 seconds. And again, right through that T, up on that T, across on that T as well, okay? Ready? Set there, well done. Well done. Little different setup. So now we will only use two plus.
but sometimes with your taps, you want to make sure that you give it a good pull. That's where my reach comes in, that I give it a good pull. That I give it a good pull. And when I go up, pull. When I come down, give it a good pull. I get no handles there. Oh, under.
Ready for a full set? Well done. Good job, boys. Then hit that one one more time. I think Elliot looks like he wants to do it one more time, so we better get it ready for him. One more quick one on that, and then we'll change it up for the last one. Okay, can you guys handle one more, I hope? And then there's one more drill, okay? Hit that one more time on the whistle. Go under and through. 
Then you gotta hit a full figure eight. Then you gotta get out again and down and up. And out, then a full figure eight. Then you gotta get up, down, then get out. You gotta hit a full figure eight, down, up, hit a full figure eight, through, full. Down and up. Good work. We just got one more to go. One more to go. That same set. Get your breath. Grab a drink. We'll finish hard on this last set. It's the same pattern. We'll start it on the whistle again. Looks like most of you got it set up really well. Cade, nice job of setting yours up. Good job there, Lynx. Looking pro. Good job, Ewan. Looks like you got it set up. Using some pucks to go through and under. That's good. Sticks to go over. I think during this time, all of you could have built uh, two pucks and a stick like AJ did. I think everybody, everybody could have done that during this time. Unless you were really busy with other stuff, you could, you could add two pucks and a stick. Because every, every video I've watched has something to go under, something to go over. Ready for your last one.
Good. Good, you can finish with a little bit of freestyle if you want. Freestyle. I'll give you one. I'll get, uh, I'll get Dylan to get it. So try something a little different here. Where is Dylan Nader? Is he on? Yeah, there he is. So I'll unmute Dylan. We'll give him the spotlight. And I'll unmute him. Are you unmuted there, kid? Yeah. Hello. You're going to give them one, OK? Make sure we can see you. OK. Okay, we're ready. You let us know. Go slow, because I I'm not the fastest guy. Okay, so. Okay. Okay. We'll flip our stick over the yes. back end. Yeah. So we can bounce off the ground, back up, and off the shaft. Ah. Okay. So a forehand, backhand, and an off the shaft and then a down up. Is that correct, Dylan? Yeah. Okay, you stay on the spotlight. You got the spotlight ready. your breath, bring your water in. Holy smokes, my weatherman is going to get fired. It's pretty sunny in South Calgary right now. So I hope everyone's doing good. I know this is still not the most fun but it's sure fun when I get to see you guys being athletic and keeping healthy. That's kind of the main thing. Um, 
I know there's, you know, it's tough everywhere. I think about the Brooks kids a lot because I hear there's a lot of, a lot of virus there. Um, then I think selfishly, we, I wish hockey would start sooner, but I see a few rinks are trying to give it a go. I haven't seen anything in, in Calgary yet. So, um, but on the positive, it's, it's Mother's Day. It's Mother's Day tomorrow. So I hope, I hope that you all have your Mother's Day gifts selected. Can I unmute all of you now I can hear you all. I hope you have your Mother's Day gifts picked out or at least a card made or at least a plan of some sort. You're gonna need a plan for Mother's Day. Okay, big heart for moms. Okay, you're gonna need some support for mom. Um, 20 guys again, so I'm assuming you're still liking it. The only reason I'm canceling tomorrow is because I didn't think we might, I didn't think we'd get everybody. So if you guys are up for a shooting on Monday night or Monday at a four, late afternoon before supper, we can add some shooting then. Okay, get outside. Have any of you golfed yet at a, at a real golf course? No. Not yet? No, me neither. I'm tempted. Oh yeah, I know there's always the field. I'm always scared I'll break another window though. But uh, I hope you guys are doing well. I see Karen and his little brother on and Oliver and his little brother were on. I see Big E, Big Eric there. I see Big AJ, Elijah. Just chilling out in the front, okay? Big John and Chestermere. Tyson's killing it there with his nice little room. Lincoln has a brand new rink, so we're all jealous a little bit. Anyway, good to see all of you guys. Get out on, how many guys got rollerblades? I got some. Yeah. I do. yeah. Almost everybody or half our group, maybe it's a rollerblade day today, right? I tried and I almost broke my neck, so be careful out there. I'm still trying to figure out how to stop. Besides running into a tree or a car, it would be nice to know how to stop once in a while. So good luck on your rollerblades. Enjoy the weather. Enjoy your Mother's Day. I know, I know Nate's been working for two weeks for his mom for something. That's great. I don't know what it's going to be. I think he built her a, a fort or something. Good luck to all of you, okay? We'll see you guys soon. See you Monday, hopefully, okay? Good job today. Thanks, Kevin. Thanks, Kevin. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you, Coach.